What the f***? Diddy Peaks, let's go! Uh, much of what is used in Hollywood today that would be considered Luciferian in nature uh, really comes from a lot of the Druidic incantations, the Druidic witchcraft, the worship of, of Gaia, of Earth. The music business is completely fraternal. Okay? Yeah. It's completely fraternal. There is no one that has not made it somewhere that is high level, that is not involved in some way, shape, or form in a fraternal order. And prior to that, you can trace that through Kabbalistic uh, witchcraft, Jewish mysticism, all the way back, really, to what was going on in Babylon. I know Illuminati exists. It, it's a level of success where it's a door. It's a door. I'm not sure if it's homo or if it's Illuminati. My name is Stephen Round, and I am a second grade teacher in the Providence School Department. I wish to read this <clears throat> letter of resignation to you. One of Jay-Z's songs was, I am so illuminated, I may glow in the dark. And now his understudy comes in with a tour called Glow in the Dark Tour. It is completely esoteric. Yeah. It is completely a play on words that people have no idea. As a perception on television and film, I was basically the fly on the wall. That's why this brother is so correct. There you go, we're so correct when he says we are at war. And I know it's somewhat Jimmy difficult to believe that a war can be anything other than physical, but it is. When you get to a level of success, when you get 30, 40, 50,000 of shows, you platinum, you're running across the world, there's, a, there's three different doors, right? There's three different ways to war. There's to the left, there's to the right, and then there's straight. There has been a specific strategy in place from the multi-generational purveyors and practitioners of witchcraft to create what Russ calls super soldiers. Sit around and talk about rap music, listen to rap music, hang out with rappers. Well, hell, I'd have done that for free. So for me and the fellas around me, it was all fun, but we did not know that we were a part of a system. I had no idea that the big picture was being a part of this system. These are SRAs, folks. SRA is satanic ritual abuse. It's what you term the victims, SRA victims who are often quote end quote multiples. Multiples simply means, as Dave just indicated, their personalities have been specifically and scientifically fractured into multiple personalities. Did I sell my soul? I sold my soul for you. Now figure that out. Tell me that I sell my soul, I sold my soul for you. For all you motherfuckers that's on here, that's asking me that I sell my soul, why the fuck is y'all on here if y'all think I sold my soul? Y'all coming right with me. Get dummies. And they flash their signals all over their album covers all the time. Yes, yes. It's in their signal, it's in their covers, it's in the music videos. So I want people to understand that there's a, a distinct through line from the time that the Babylonians were sacrificing kids to Moloch in the temple at the top of the Tower of Babel, at the top of that construct. From, from the time that they, that, they, that they attempted to slap God right in the face with that stuff. I was approached here because of my connections within the music industry. I was taken to a, uh, a penthouse of a, a particular gentleman who's uh, of European descent, let's say. And uh, he prefaced himself before he invited me into one of his orders. To Hollywood today, you could do an exhaustive study and find a distinct through line in the practice of witchcraft. A lot of people are kind of born into this. They grow up in it, they are abused, and through the abuse, especially as a child, you can break someone's subconscious mind. It rewires their subconscious to be more receptive and open to being abused. Before everybody starts screaming and saying, oh, like I told y'all earlier, you motherfuckers have entered the rapture. And if ain't nobody flying up to heaven right now, obviously all y'all motherfuckers going to hell. Right with me. So, let's get it. Oh, you already here. I'm so sorry. You can't get out. You're stuck. It's over. You heard the songs a million times and you didn't even know. That's
us fucked up. In the attempt to conform and abide by the misguided notions of educrats, the school system in which I had so much pride drastically changed. Rather than creating lifelong learners, our new goal is to create good test takers. Straight is your own, y'all. To the right. I'm not sure if that's the homo shit right there. And then there's to the left. I'm not sure if there's some sacrifice shit going on right there. I'm not sure because I went straight. But I was offered these doors. He knew about me and my uh, music business connection. And so what he said to me, he said, we need people who have contacts to be able to influence the thought processes of individuals. In multi-generational witchcraft, among the initiates, what, what many call the Illuminati, that they infiltrated the military chaplaincy, they infiltrated the medical community, they infiltrated academia back in the early 70s. Everything you see on television and you read and you hear on that radio, hate on it. And the, and, the, and the purpose of knowing about Jay-Z and a lot of these rap artists in the secret societies is not really to obsess over it because the magical way to, to dead all of that is to ignore it, it doesn't exist. And put in place, uh, Dave, it's a sub Rosa army. And the most, the most frightening thing about this army is they are weaponized for, for the deep state, for the dark state, and yet, in many cases, they don't even know it. This is a, te a technique that is a self-defense mechanism, particularly with children. Uh, it was perfected at you know Tavistock Institute after World War One. Twitter has been suppressing me. Twitter, uh, YouTube, Google, Facebook—they've been suppressing this information. They don't want you, the people worldwide. They don't want you. They don't want you to know. What they do is they play a good cop, bad cop routine with children, often employing heinous sexual behavior, orgiastic behavior, homosexual behavior, animal dismemberment, bloodletting, and in many cases, at the end of the day, murder, when they decide to dispose of an experiment that uh, didn't work. Rather than being the recipients of a rewarding and enjoyable educational experience, our students are now relegated to experiencing a confining and demeaning education. There are several generations of these super soldiers that are essentially, Dave, satanic Manchurians. They are locked, loaded, ready for action to be activated by their handlers at a given time.